So recently I uploaded a video talking about budget camping gear from Amazon that I've used bike packing that just didn't really work for me. And because you guys like that video so much, I decided to make another video talking about budget camping gear from Amazon that I absolutely love and use on almost all of my backpacking trips. So let's just jump right into it. So starting off with another Wise Owl Outfitters product, we have the Wise Owl Travel Towel. I got this in size medium and it is about $11. Something that I learned pretty quickly after a couple of bikepacking trips is that you don't want to leave home without a small towel because it is not fun drying yourself off with your clean clothes or even your dirty clothes. You just don't wanna get caught in that kind of situation. I find it to be the perfect balance between size and packability. It's big enough to wrap around my waist and it also dries really quickly. This particular package also comes with a little washcloth. It's sometimes really nice to have some kind of cloth to wipe your face off while you're biking or just to have this to dry dishes or something like that. I often just stuff this in my stove. It packs up pretty small. I usually just throw this at the bottom of a bag or sometimes I put this with my clothes before I've used it, of course. It's a really convenient item to have when you are out in the wilderness. The next item of budget gear that I bring on all of my bikepacking trips and you may have seen me wielding during some of my unboxing videos is the Grand Way Spring Assisted Knife. This is a $12 knife. It is super sharp. Now I know that some people are very particular about their knives. I don't know anything about knives. I just wanted something that opened really quickly and was really sharp. And this does that job. It isn't super light, but that's something that I'm willing to trade off. Knives can get really expensive. Camping knives can get really expensive. So this is what works for me. Now, before I bought this knife, I had an Openel number 30 knife, which has the corkscrew. Because I bike pack in a lot of places that are really humid, this knife gets really hard to open because the wood soaks up the moisture from the air. And so a lot of times I'll wake up in the morning and try to get this knife open and it, it won't open. As much as I really like the feature of having a corkscrew, not being able to open the knife was a deal breaker. So I went and looked for a more budget knife and found this and I feel really happy with it. The next piece of gear that I wanna show you guys that I love is the Wildo Bolda Cup. I think they were designed by the Swedish military. I might be wrong in that. You guys can fact check that. Uh, in the comments below if you need to. This is a tiny little cup that folds really, really small. It holds 200 milliliters of liquid or about eight ounces. This for me is the perfect size for a cup of espresso or a strong cup of coffee. While other cups might be a little bit more comfortable, this one isn't very insulated. It's just a foldable piece of plastic. I find that the packability of this is so nice. I can throw it in my food bag. I can throw it into my stove. It's really small. It's really light. I bought it for about five bucks off of Amazon. I will put an Amazon link in the description below, but just know that sometimes these are kind of hard to find cheaply on Amazon and that you can find them in other places as well. And the last budget item that I have today is the MSR folding spork. I love this little spork. It is tiny, it is super light, it's just a couple of grams, just a few ounces, and it cost me about $3. I do sometimes use a Tox titanium spork, which you can see the comparison here. I find the folding spork to just be really, really nice because I can fit this into very easily into my pot. It's not bulky, it's not an odd shape it's very unobtrusive. And so this is one of these tiny pieces of gear that I just find really convenient. Now, I will say that the plastic is a little bit flimsy. A lot of the reviews say that it breaks really easily. I haven't found this to be the case, but I could see if you were trying to scoop like a ton of food, I mean, this, this is gonna break, you know? You can't put a whole lot of weight on it, but for $3, how much can you really ask for? Now, I would love to try out a titanium version of a spork like this. If you guys have any suggestions, please let me know in the comments below. All right, guys, that's all I have for you today. If you like this video, please hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. I'm trying to hit a thousand followers by November, by my birthday, and I'd really appreciate your support. That's all I have for you for now, so I'll see you guys next time.